So this is the great foyer. See this sun? I only need ten more. God, these fucking knights. They're so cool. And so scary. I mean, not these ones particularly. They are kind of creepy, just whacking nothing. But there are some knights in this game that are just... Oh, oh my god. Oh, they gave me fears. I must sound like such a pussy. Constantly talking about how all the things in this game make me scared. Well, being scared is fun. You know, I pity the people who watch so many horror movies that they can't get scared by things anymore. Salazar Slytherin. I guess I will view the Folio Magi this time. Salazar Slytherin. Medieval. Dates unknown. Co-founder of Hogwarts. Gave his name to one of the four Hogwarts houses. Hogwarts houses? Newt Scamander. 1897 to present. Celebrated author of Fantastic Beasts. Morgan Le Fay. Medieval. Dates unknown. King Arthur's half-sister. Dark Source. Derwent Shimpling. 1912 to present, ate an entire venomous tentacular for a bet and survived. <laughs> Though it's still purple. <laughs> that is so funny, Harry. Fuck you. Merlin, medieval, dates unknown, most famous wizard of all time, sometimes known as Prince of the Enchant. That's enough of that. It's kind of interesting, but really, who cares about what there's on the wizards? Especially not for a let's play, I mean, what's more interesting than just looking through that, uh, playing the game, probably? Gryffindor Tower, don't want to go there. Um, I've just been there, so I guess this way. I don't know why I did that. I think I remember, that was like just a, a reflex reaction. I know that I talked to that guy, if you go up to him. So I was trying to jump past. Yeah. I'm going here before you have to talk to him, yeah. I don't know whether that's helpful at all, I just, I like doing it. Help me Harry! Some nasty Slytherin student has charmed all of my chocolate frogs, pumpkins, and cauldrons into the air! Please help me to get them back by using your knockback chunks to bring them down. Well, sure. Alright, this was the, the dumbest fucking minigame. And it was annoying as fuck. Because the timing was annoying to get the hang of. And the timer didn't seem long enough. I guess I'm good at it though. Yep, I'm too good at it now. Just like with everything else. Thank you, Harry. Here, have my famous Witches and Wizards card as a reward. Though they do get much harder, I think. Also, where am I? Cornelius. Cornelius Agrippa, probably. I might cut out those loading screens, but if I say that, that means you'll be expecting me to, and then uh, I'll have to edit all the videos, and I don't want to bother. Watch out for the suits of armor. I think Peeves has been at work. I hope I never meet one. Why do people just say things and run away? Okay, first off kind of weird that that guy is just standing here waiting for somebody to say, you know, beware of the suits of armor. There they are, suits of armor. 
suits of arm. And the way he said, like, Peeves has been at work, and then I hope I never meet one. You mean, you know, you hope you never meet a Peeves? Muscle memory, motherfuckers. I did that, that whole thing in like one second. I feel kind of bad that it's so easy. Am I sounding like a pretentious prick? This game's easy. Look, I can do it. I can run circles around this book. It doesn't even... I can't even read. Let's save the game. Just in case something terrible happens. Okay, now that I've got... How many beans? I've got 50 out of 50. I've also got 70 out of 70, so I can go get the two things. Alright. Good. Gryffindor Tower. Actually, that's the wrong way to go, but uh, I don't care. Oh no, it's the right way. I need to go to Fred and George, then I need to go to the portrait, then I need to go outside to get to the other Fred and George, to get the other password for the other portrait, and yeah, they're in here. Password? Caput Draconis! Gryffindor common room, everybody. First time being in here. It is quite a nice place to just hang out, I guess. It's a nice carpet. Thanks for the earwax flavour beans. The password for the portrait of the old posh baron is Fizzy Pop. Hope you find the portrait. It'll be worth it. See you around. And Harry just watches them go to the Whoa! They didn't disappear. They jumped in the fire. Flu powder, anybody? Whoa. Oh yeah, this You can read the Daily Prophet read these. Please keep the common room tidy. Sure. Yeah. Somebody hasn't been following that rule, these frogs. For sale, issues one to six of the adventures of Martin Miggs, the mad muggle. Three sickles each. Hmm. Uh, okay. Lost. One toad. If found, please return to Neville Longbottom. It's always with that toad with him. Potions lesson one. Don't forget a sloth brain. Sloth. Sloth. I'm trying to think. There's a scone and scone. I always did scone. What do you do? Scones? Scones? Sloth and sloth. Tomato and tomato. Potato and potato. Out now. The Nimbus 2000. Whoa. Nimbus 2000. What is that? It doesn't say it's a broomstick. Harry, you're, you've been a muggle, basically, up until this point. How do you know about it? I guess somebody told you. Gringotts break-in latest. Investigations continue into the break-in at Gringotts. Rumoured to be the work of dark wizards. Gringotts goblins today insisted that nothing had been taken. The contents of the vault in question, which remain unidentified, had been withdrawn earlier that same day. See, that always confused me, because when I was a kid, I didn't really understand the plot of Harry Potter that much. You know, I got the idea that Harry was the boy who lived and Voldemort was evil and they had to get past Fluffy, but things like the break-in at Gringotts, the bit with the newspaper and they're sitting around the table and Harry's going, that's weird, that's the vault Hagrid and I entered, and it's like, yeah. So was the break-in when Hagrid took the thing? But then I realised, like, years later, break-in doesn't necessarily mean stolen. There was a break-in into the bank. Some evil wizards broke into Gringotts, looking for the thing that Hagrid had already taken, and they, after fi realizing that it already had been gone, which is basically just Death Eaters, I think about it. Death Eaters smashed into Gringotts to take something that Hagrid, Harry knew Hagrid had taken from the vault, and it, yeah, I get it now is what I'm getting at, I understand. Fizzy Pop. Well done, young sir. That's the correct password. Let's see if I can get these old hinges working. Oh, here we go. Huh. Speaking of a Nimbus 2000, what's this?
Oh, it's the Nimbus 2000. 